from the DS5 main menu, select File, and then New, and then C Project to display the C Project dialog box. In the Project Name field, enter Hello World as the name of the project. Under Project Type, select Executable, and then Empty Project. Under Tool Chains, select the compiler you have just imported. Click Finish to create a C project called Hello World. You can view the project in the Project Explorer view. Now, right-click the Hello World project and select New, and then Source File. In the New Source File dialog, enter the file name hello underscore world dot c. Click Finish to create the source file and open it in the Code Editing view. The source file is also visible in the Project Explorer view under the Hello World project. Write the following Hello World example code. Locate your Hello World project in the Project Explorer view, right-click it, and select Properties. In the Properties dialog, navigate to C, C++ Build, and then Settings. Select all configurations in the Configurations list. Select GCC, C-Linker, and then Miscellaneous, and in the Other Flags field, enter this. Click OK to apply and close the Properties dialog. Locate your Hello World project in the Project Explorer view, right-click it, and select Build Project. You can view the Build Output console by selecting Window, then Show View, then Console. If the build succeeded, you should see the binary file hello world.axf in the debug folder. Double click to open it. You can inspect the header, sections, symbol table, and disassembly with the ELF content editor. From the DS5 main menu, select Run and then Debug Configurations. In the Debug Configurations dialog, select DS5 Debugger. Then, click the new Launch Configuration button. This creates a new DS5 Debug Configuration and displays the various tabs required to specify settings for loading your application on the target. In the Debug Configurations dialog, give a name to the Debug Configuration. For example, Hello World. In the Connection tab, under Select Target, browse and select ARM Model, and then ARM V8 AX1 Foundation Platform, then Bare Metal Debug, and then Debug ARM V8A. Select the Files tab, and under Target Configuration, in the Application on Host to Download field, click Workspace. The Workspace folder, Hello World, then Debug, contains the Hello World.axf application file you created when you built the Hello World project. Select that, and then click OK. Ensure that the Load Symbols option is selected in the Files tab. Select the Debugger tab, and ensure the Debug from Symbol option is selected and set to Main. Click Debug to load the application on the target, and load the debug information into the debugger. In the Confirm Perspective Switch dialog that appears, click Yes. DS5 connects to the model and displays the connection status in the debug control view. The application is loaded onto the target, and is stopped at the main function, ready to run. The Commands view 
displays messages output by the debugger. You can also use this view to enter DS5 commands. The disassembly view shows the loaded program in memory as addresses and assembler instructions. The blue arrow indicates the location in the code where your program has stopped. In this case, it is at the main function. Use the controls provided in the debug control view to step through the application. Click the continue button to continue running the application. You can view the application output in the target console view. To disconnect from a debug connection, you can either right click the connection and select disconnect from target or select the connection in the debug control view toolbar.